Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below hashtag 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 Java User Authentication Tutorial. User authentication is a crucial part of any application that needs to ensure that users are who they claim to be. In this tutorial, we'll explore a simple user authentication mechanism using Java. This will include storing user credentials securely, validating user input, and providing feedback. Hashtag 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 prerequisites. Basic knowledge of Java. Java Development Kit, JDK, installed. An IDE, like IntelliJ IDEA, Eclipse, or NetBeans. Maven or Gradle for dependency management, optional. Hashtag 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 step 1, set up your project. Create a new Java project in your IDE. If you're using Maven, you can create a simple pom.xml for dependency management. For this tutorial, we will not use any external libraries, but in a real-world application, you might want to use libraries like Spring Security. Hashtag 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 step 2, create the user model. We will create a simple user class to represent our user data. Hashtag 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 step 3, create a user database. For simplicity, we will use a list to store our users. In a real application, you would typically use a database. Hashtag 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 step 4, implement authentication logic. Next, we will create an authenticator class to handle the authentication logic. Hashtag 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 step 5, create the main application. Finally, we will create a simple console application to test our authentication. Hashtag 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 step 6, running the application. 1. Compile and run the main class. 2. Enter the username admin and the password admin 123 to authenticate successfully. Hashtag 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 important considerations. 1. Password storage. In this example, passwords are stored in plain text, which is highly insecure. In a real application, always hash passwords using a strong algorithm, example BCRYPT, and store the hash. 2. Input validation. Always validate and sanitize user inputs to prevent security vulnerabilities such as SQL injection or XSS. 3. Security. Implement additional security measures such as account lockout after multiple failed attempts, two-factor authentication, etc. 4. Frameworks. For larger applications, consider using frameworks like Spring Security that provide robust authentication and authorization features out of the box. 5. Database. For production applications, use a database, like MySQL, PostgreSQL, etc., to store user information securely. Hashtag 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 conclusion. In this tutorial, we created a simple user authentication system in Java. This example serves as a foundation to build upon for more complex and secure authentication mechanisms. Always prioritize security best practices when handling user credentials.